Well, certainly on his way to earning enough money to be able to do these sorts of things, we are joined by an unbelievably talented singer, songwriter, guitarist, Hugh Lynn this morning. He's already proven his chops with a beautiful performance. One more on the way. Um, but I love the fact that you represent this kind of creative hub. How does the creator, and I ask this of every artist because I'm obsessed, because it's always different. Yeah. Where does the creative process begin with you? Because it's informed from so many different angles. Is it with pen yeah. and paper? Is it guitar in hand? Where do the juices start to flow, man? You know, it's actually quite funny. Uh, a lot of people think you need inspiration to write a song. But, you know, it's actually possible to write a song about anything, like anything. Like, as an example, my sister's got this little hourglass thing when she, you know, brushes the teeth. Oh, for sure, you know? yeah, and yeah, my mother's got one as well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I just played with the thing, you know, and then it fell on the side. And then I just got an idea. Hang on. Time stood still, you know. That's a, an awesome topic, you know, for, for, for any song, so. I love that. So, you don't need inspiration for a song. You can just look at something and write a song about it. And, you know, there's yeah. a poor songwriter who's got a deadline to meet at 12 o'clock today going, Unless damn it, man, <laughs> no, I need inspiration right now. I need it. That's Maybe true. we'll give you that in just a, a moment. Yeah. What else do you do to keep yourself level? Because you can't stay in this machine all yeah. the time. How do you kind of bring light and shade and step yeah. out of this, this bubble so you're not writing a song every yes. time an hourglass falls over? Yeah. So uh, for, the, for the past five years, I've been doing my BEC in sound engineering. So um, I got like a basic knowledge to troubleshoot and, you know, electronics and kind of things and sound and, you know, I just, just like to deassemble things. To tinker. Just, just yeah. things, whatever. Uh, just like, yeah, exactly, tinker, good word. <laughs> yeah, just to mess around, you know, check the design out and kind of things. That's what I love to do. And other than that, I'm just basically focusing on music right now. That's because you love that's it, man. Basically, all I do. Yeah. You're so good. You're so good at it, man. I love <laughs> it. I love seeing people live their truth, and you're going to do it right now with one of our favorites, man. I adore the song. Cannot wait to hear his spin. It's "Take Yours and I'll Take Mine" by Matthew Mole, as done by Hugh Lynn. Enjoy, Ooh. bro. Yeah. 
Oi, oi. How did, how did that feel, man? How did that feel? A bit nerve-breaking. A bit nerve-breaking. <laughs> I love it. You know what I love, dude, is looking into your eyes, dude. There are these little moments where you just light up, and that smile is awesome, dude. The Thank fact you that so you, you clearly are doing what you need to be doing right now. I'm so chuffed that you Thank are here you so today, much. my friend. We are going to have a, one more performance coming from Hugh just for you. Well, a little bit for us, but mainly just for you. We'll see you now.